Good morning, Daniel. We're going to shoot a video to show you how easy it is to make rolls. It is quarter to nine. All right. You can see we're... Good morning. Good morning. There's the doggies. There's Miley. Of course, now she's going to get up out of the way. Okay. Here's the recipe I use. Don't worry about it. I'll send it to you later. All right. So I've kind of already taking the liberty let me get the camera set I've already kind of taken the liberty of putting everything together got uh, supposed to be seven cups of flour I only do half so three and a half cups of flour okay yeast freshman's quick high rising yeast Goes right in. Recipe calls for a half a cup of sugar. This is a fourth a cup. Remember, you, you we're using half. All right, touch of salt. So I use a little salt balance. I don't use much. That's it. Okay. Ooh. All right, hang on. Got to have some coffee. Ooh, that is pulled. All right. So, then it calls for one egg, and of course we get our eggs from across the street, from fresh eggs, one egg, all right, and at this point I got to look at the recipe, because it says we should have two and a half, or two cups of warm water, water, so we're going to go one cup of water. Right? Half a cup. Half the recipe. Okay, so here's what I do ahead of time. Okay, can we get that going? Add the water. Two and a half, which is kneading, because you're kneading hot rolls. That's funny. We're kneading roll mix, and you're kneading hot rolls. Hmm. Oh, okay. Now it's starting to pull together. That's what you're looking for. See how that elasticity? Don't go more than the kneading. Don't mix it. Kneading should be kind of slow. And I use the dough hooks. Not those hooks. Okay. And I just do this to make sure the, it, gets, it gets all pulled together and all the flour gets picked up. So you need it for about three, maybe four minutes. And then... Take a bowl. Spray it. Okay, 
when this is done, this is going in there. Sticky, you'd rather have it sticky than uh, where you can't get to it. Trial and error. So I put it in there, put it in a bowl, and then I'm going to cover it with saran wrap. And you're going to leave it in a nice warm place, not in the oven, not on, but a uh, nice warm place. And then let it rise till it's double. Okay? Then you punch it down, let it rest for 15 minutes, and then I'll show you the other part of it. Okay?